everybody, welcome back to All Club Honey Productions, and today is Deferred Vlog on my channel, where I am going to present this Canis Unicornis dog to my school for a science project. So, it's been a couple hours now, and it'll be a couple minutes before I'll present my LPS model. Oh, where am I? This place looks new. Oh, oh my gosh! Kill, kill, kill and destroy! Kill and destroy! Kill and destroy! Kill and destroy! Oh my gosh, I gotta get out of here! Uh, 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 uh. Hello there! Uh, how do I get out of this place? Oh my gosh! The cat is trapped! No! Kill, 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 and destroy! Why the heck am I in this insane asylum? Of stuff! Kill, 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 and destroy! I like killing and destroying things with my axe and arrow! Kill and destroy! <laughs> I think I ate too much nachos yesterday. As for other species, let's just say they are very unfortunate. Antis will eat anything that wiggles around and can be stuffed in their mouth. The antis love killing, uh, hunting and killing their food almost as much as eating it. They will roam in large groups and packs that, that once they have get enough gathered, will return to their colony. If a man were to come across and intrude one of these settlements, the antish would not stop attacking the trespasser until he is dead. So it's basically going to go for everything, including, including humans, if it's dumb enough. <laughs> well, you'll see later. But it uses its sharp claws, which I have not shown, because it goes it, to reproduction. It goes through extremely common mutations, including three heads, one head. Multiple toes or fingers. This is a Ilundia centurusis, which also knows as a fluffy thing. <laughs> so basically, um, it uses um, its body covering. Like this isn't its face; it's just like a body covering to um, scare off predators. Your animal, and then tell us the name. So this here is the Canis Unicornis, aka Unicorn Dog in English, and this is a wild dog breed that lives in on the coasts of the beaches of North and South America, and it's a social animal that only trusts the other members of its pack, which could have as much as a hundred dogs or twenty dogs. And, and the dog uses its horn as a weapon along with its bite where it stabs its prey and its enemies such as predators and unfamiliar dogs with its horn along with growls and bites. And it uses its wings much like a penguin's to glide through the water and swim and stuff to hunt for its underwater prey. And the tail is just there for the sake of body language. So yeah, that's the unicorn dog. Any questions? How so. does it exactly survive in the wild if it only attacks predators? Because it also attacks its prey. Well, yeah. What kind of prey? <laughs> small, it uh, small rodents and fish and snakes and stuff. It would even, even attack newborn sea turtles if it had the chance to. Okay, thank you very much. Call someone else. Hi. 
Have you? I used it in real life? It's like the size of a Dodge Hound or a Basset Hound. It looks like I'm here again. <laughs> Okay, what the fuck is that? I'm out of here. <laughs>